Hi everyone, welcome to Medicine Note YouTube channel. Here we are going to see about amyloidosis. This term was first used by Rudolf Virchow after shining in iodine. After 5 years, they recognized this amyloidosis is a protein, as a protein. It is derived from the word amalga, amylum in Latin which means cellulose or starch. The amyloid is an abnormal deposit of insoluble polymeric protein fibril in tissue and organs. It is an abnormal deposit of protein in tissue organs. The condition of deposition of amyloid in the tissue is known as amyloidosis. The condition of deposition of the amyloid is known as amyloidosis. Amyloid is an pathogenic proteinous substance deposited between the cells in various tissue and organs of the body in wide variety of clinical setting. This amyloid is a pathological it is a proteinous substance deposited in various tissue and organs in the all parts of the body. Mostly different part of the different organs of the body in wide variety of clinical setting. These fibrils, the fibril deposition takes place in this amyloid formation. These fibrils are formed in misfolding of the proteins. These fibrils are deposited in extracellular, not intracellular. They are they are deposited extracellularly, not intracellularly. Amyloidosis is not a single disease, rather it is a group of inflammatory and inherited disease having common deposition of similar appearing protein. It is, amyloidosis is not a single disease. It is a group of disease which is causes inflammatory as well as inherited disease having common deposition of a similar protein. There is only one similar protein appearing in both inflammatory and inherited it causes both inflammatory and inherited diseases ultrastructure or and biochemistry of the amyloid it contains 90 to 95 percentage of non branched fibers of diameter 10 to 12 nanometer 5 to 10 percentage protein compound of glycoprotein Glycoprotein which is composed of the 5 to 10 percentage of protein compost which is composed of glycoprotein, fibronectin, laminin and collagen 4. Nature of amyloid The physical nature It is a non-branching protein fiber of diameter 7.5 to 10 nanometer in diameter which looks like beta plated sheets. Chemical nature 95 percentage of the protein fibrils. Most common amyloid amyloids are amyloid light chain, which is AL. It is derived from plasma cell and contains immunoglobin light chain. AA. It is amyloid associated, derived from unique and non-immunoglobulin protein made by liver. Derived from a unique non-immunoglobin protein made by liver. A beta amyloid found in cerebral lesion of Alzheimer disease. The patients who have Alzheimer disease, they are, these are found in the cerebral lesion. A beta 2 microglobulin seen in the patients of long term hemodialysis. And other biochemical forms of amyloid are transthyretin, is deposited in the patients like polynephritis and heart age individual. These are the common forms of the amyloids. Now we are going to see about the pathogenesis of amyloids. Amyloid results in form of abnormal folding of protein deposited as fibril in extracellular tissue. It is an abnormal folding of protein deposited as fibrils in extracellular tissue. Normally the misfolded protein are degraded by intracellularly by proteosomes or extracellular by macrophages. Normally this, uh, these types of misfolder proteins are degraded by intracellularly by 
proteasomes, extracellulary by macrophages. Commonly, the pathway of the pathogenesis of the amyloid is, is there is a stimulus and soluble misfolding proteins are formed, and these misfolded proteins are changed into insoluble proteins. Pathogenesis can be divided into acquired and genetic. Acquired unknown stimulus like uh, carcinogenic, which stimulates the proliferation of the monoclonal cell which stimulates the beta cell and transform to plasma cell. These beta cells are transformed to plasma cell. There is a formation of immunoglobulin light chain, which is a misfolder protein. And this results in AL protein deposition. And here the chronic inflammation, there is activation of macrophage. Interleukin 1 and 6 are secreted. Which, is, which acts on the liver to produce SAA protein which is a misfolded protein which transform to AA amyloid formation. Genetic cause the mutant transthyretin gene which genetically alter the structure of transthyretin. This is prone to misfolding and abnormal aggregation and this results in amyloid formation. Classification of amyloid. According to the source of protein, they are classified in 20 different identified. There are 20 different types identified according to the source of protein. According to the distribution, they are divided into systemic as well as localized. Systemic, primary amyloidosis. It is no other disease can cause this condition. Secondary amyloidosis, it occurs because of the another disease or a situation. The systemic is divided into primary and secondary amyloidosis. Localized Senile cerebral, senile cardiac, type 2 diabetes. These are the classification of the amyloidosis. Thank you. For more video, please do subscribe, like, share and comment.